Say hi to my sister. <laughs> With her bum leg. <laughs> So back in December, I went on vacation to South Korea and Japan with my sister and come and join me on this journey as I go through each day and share with you some of my favorite highlights. Now the place that we were staying in was Hongdae. Um, it's a very lively area during the nighttime, but since it was so early in the day, you can tell there's not very many people walking about on the streets. Um, but we decided that since it was my first day out and about, uh, one of the first things that we would do uh, since we skipped breakfast was to go straight for lunch. Now the place that my sister had taken me was uh, this one restaurant that she had previously been to and as you will see, how they set it up is that they have this ginormous pot filled with different assortments of uh, veggies, chicken, tteokbokki, and cheese filled tteokbokki or uh, tteokbokki filled with cheese and it has a ring around of cheese around it so after it's all cooked you can actually go ahead and just dip your food into the cheese and just savor the gloriousness that was this dish. It's my favorite. After lunch, uh, we decided to go ahead and just walk through the streets of Hongdae. Like I mentioned before, this is a very lively street toward the very end of the day where it's on nighttime. Uh, there's tons of clubs that you can find, but you can also go through just alleys and streets of just shopping, food, street food, uh, karaoke, and all, all these different things. That's um, and from what I remember, uh, there's a very popular university that's not very far from Hongdae, uh, so, which is probably one of the reasons why it is so popular. Uh, you could definitely find a lot of different um, places to find skincare or Korean beauty, tons of souvenirs for friends and family. I tried to hold back on the shopping for the first day because I knew I was going to be shopping a whole lot. And like I mentioned, this was during Christmas time. I couldn't help but enjoy all this cuteness. And here I am chasing a bird. So like I mentioned, at nighttime, the street becomes a little bit more busier. This is um, just off. Uh, one street off to the side from the previous street that I was on with my sister. This is the main road. And as you can see, there's, been, uh, there's a lot more people walking down the roads. There's more restaurants, more karaoke places. Um, this happened to be a street vendor. She had her dog with her and she let me take a cute video of it. And like I mentioned, street food. One of the things that I was looking forward to when I came to Korea was to try all the different street food. Unfortunately, I didn't get to try very much. Um, because I did not know how the street food worked, especially in Myeongdong, but that's for another day. Anyway, like I mentioned, this place is probably one of my favorites that I had stayed in. Um, there's just so many different things to look at. And one of the cool things about Hongdae is that you will see a lot of street performers. <laughs> So 
so that's it for my first day here in Hongdae. Um, I'm just walking through the streets because I saw a lot of lights. But this was the last thing that I did. Uh, tomorrow, me and my sister are going to be going to Daegu. And you'll get to see that little adventure as well. So please come back and join me on day two of my vacation in South Korea.